to a, a disappointing result, but an improved performance from last week from the Rhinos? Yeah, definitely disappointing. Um, you know, last week, obviously last week was disappointing as well. We're looking to bounce back, but um, you know, tonight wasn't good enough. Uh, you know, I thought there was good patches throughout the game where, you know, we were dominant, and you know, if you're watching the game, you can probably see that we, uh, we were over top of them. So, you know, they scored four four tries off kicks. You know, that's that's uh, some of them were lucky, but uh, yeah, that's that's football, and you know, sometimes you get luck. Um, but you know, I think we we kind of done it to ourselves. You know. Um, penalties, you know, errors, um, yeah, so a bit disappointing. Um, yeah. Can we take encouragement from that defensive effort at the start of the second half? They were, they were battering away and low managed to hold them out? Yeah, yeah, we take a lot of pride in our defence and our defensive line. Um, you know, we do a lot of work. Um, you know, Frenzy said it, you know, we do that at training and, you know, the way we did defend our line, um, you know, if we can just do that, uh, you know, up the field a bit more, I think, you know, take a lot from that. The opening two games were always going to be a tough two grand finalists uh, back to back. Uh, how have you, have you found the, the two, last two games? Yeah, they've been really tough, you know, especially that Warrington one. Um, you know, we just kind of got dominated uh, throughout the 80 minutes. Um, you know, but tonight, you know, it was a bit better. Um, you know, we had periods where, like I said before, you know, we were over top of them and, um, you know, I felt like we were grinding them away. Um, yeah, the scoreboard kind of didn't really tell the game a bit, to be honest. Um, yeah, and at the end we were chasing the game, but yeah, and that's when errors we had. The uh, try for Brett Ferris, uh, you, you set that one up. Uh, how far out did you know Brett was coming out? He came at some speed coming at that reverse angle. Yeah, I could see him flying. Um, well, I knew straight away, I'll just give him the ball. Um, it's kind of hard to, um, to stop someone running at 100 miles an hour, and the line's about five metres away. So, um, you know, I've done a, you know, that's just kind of uh, what you call playing footy. Um, Fez just saw a hole right and you know, when you do that you're going to get the ball obviously. So. The boys have still got their, their chins up, we're looking forward to the next challenge and, and building on this one? Yeah, yeah, definitely, you know, I think it's going to take a, a weekend to kind of get over the, this, this, obviously this loss and you know, coming in Monday, um, you know, after video session just flushing it and preparing for, a, I guess, another big week, uh, you know, a long week playing Sunday next weekend against Southwood, so, um, you know, it's going to be a long build-up, but um, you know, we're going to have to take this loss and um, see how it goes.